Tuesday the 11th of June. We start the day with oral questions. The first is Simon Bridges to the Minister responsible for the GCSB. Uh, at what specific time on Tuesday the 28th of May was he or his office first contacted by the GCSB uh, telling him that they had told Treasury that the GCSB did not believe any hacking had taken place? And when did they relay that information to ministerial colleagues or their offices? Uh, Simon Bridges then to the Prime Minister, does she stand by all her government statements and actions in, in relation to the alleged unauthorised access of Budget 2019 material? So it's pretty clear where the beginning of the day is going. Uh, Kira Tapu Allen to the Minister of Finance about reaction to the budget. Uh, Amy Adams uh, to the Minister of Finance about his press statement on Tuesday the 28th of May, uh, again uh, relating to the unauthorised uh, leaking of budget material. Uh, Judith Collins to the Minister of Housing uh, about how many uh, applications have successfully pre-qualified uh, as eligible for Kiwi Build. Uh, Jan Tanetti uh, to the Minister of Education, uh, how many uh, primary and intermediate schools uh, will benefit from the government's additional funding uh, to replace parental donations. Uh, Paul Goldsmith to the Minister of Transport about uh, expected increases in national uh, land transport fund revenue uh, as a result of the increases in fuel excise duty. Uh, Angie uh, Warren Clark to the Minister of Health uh, about investment into mental health and addiction facilities. Uh, Nicky Kay uh, to the Minister of Education about his promises and whether he stands by them. Joe Luxton to the uh, Minister uh, for Economic Development. Uh, what is the government doing to enable more innovative, knowledge intensive, high value firms and startups uh, to grow and scale within New Zealand? Uh, Mark Patterson to the Minister of Defence uh, about announcements he's made on defence, and Chris Bishop to the Associate Minister of Transport about road safety. Uh, after questions, we go on to uh, a debate. Uh, on cons the consideration of a report from the Privileges Committee uh, on cyber security in the parliamentary precincts. Then on to the Appropriation Bill, which is the second reading of the budget, um, and that is likely to go through till about 8 or 8.30. Uh, then there will be the Appropriation 2018-19 Supplementary Estimates Bill, the first reading. Uh, so that will... Uh, that bill um, authorises the individual appropriations and changes uh, that were made to the budget that was presented a year ago. Uh, there's no debate on that. Uh, as with the partnership law bill, uh, it's a revision bill, uh, and what, that, what it does is bring up to date, put into uh, more accessible language, the 1908 Partnership Act. Then the, uh, we'll go on to the Oranga Tamariki Legislation Bill, the second reading in the name of uh, Tracy Martin, and I think that's about where we'll finish the evening.